Folks, I hope you're doing well. This is a touch of tarot, and we are going to be looking into your energies, see what's coming up for you. If you'd like to book a reading, my info is below. Oh, okay, good. We have our first energy, the pearl, and it's connect to the divine. This is a new deck from a viewer. I'm so grateful for it. Um, I'm really loving it. So let's see what messages come out. I do notice once I bring the tarot in, we get a lot more confirmation here. So we have the aqua energy experiencing peace and calm. And we have the overcome your challenge plum energy. So what I'm getting right off from the start is that you are connecting to the divine Leo, okay? And this is bringing some sort of peace and calm to probably a situation that you either felt you were in the, left in the dark about or in the dark about or unsure about, um, a challenging energy that you couldn't figure out. It's almost like there's a breakthrough here, right, with this energy in the aqua. I, want, I keep on wanting to say aquamarine, aquamarine. But it's almost like there's this breakthrough energy happening here, um, that's releasing you from a challenge. Okay, so let's start with that. I mean, this energy here coming out first and so beautiful. I really feel like that is something very special. Pearl energy is so beautiful, like so beautiful. So we have Queen of Swords here, Leo. Very interesting. So you could be finally seeing um, something that's beautiful and getting like the truth, the clarity in a situation that it's like you're seeing the beauty. So you're looking back to the dark energy here, or you're looking at the dark energy with an energy of just seeing it clearly and seeing all of the gifts that came from that situation, or from that dark energy. Um, I am seeing the Queen of Cups at the bottom here and the lovers. So you could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, uh, Leo, or it could just be that you're looking at a past love. Um Okay, I see a new beginning coming, but let's see what else is actually coming out. So we have the Knight of Cups here. This is a past love. Oh, I think you and this person are both looking at what happened, looking at the challenges, trying to figure out um, how this can work out, how this can, how it can fix, be fixed, be overcome. It's really interesting energy there, overcoming your challenges, both with both people looking to that. So the next message I'm getting is this, okay, Leo, I believe you and another person are kind of having worries about the future, but I also do see that you've both had a breakthrough in seeing um, the benefits that have come from this. You may have really been with this person in a serious relationship or been living with them or lived with them at one point. Um, and now I just feel like there may be a little bit of fear in this coming back together. And what your guides asking you to do is to be strong, to have faith, because actually this can work out here. Now we have the queen of pentacles so far, almost all the Queens have come out, right? Um, we got fire, we got swords, we got earth and we already saw the water. So we have saw all the queens here. If you are a female Leo, you're really embodying this courageous energy and it's going to help this situation is what I get. Um, as for this masculine, he's coming out as the king of swords now. So you and someone really have to discuss desires, needs, wants, truths, um, opening up and this will bring some calmness and some peace to a divine connection. Like we do have the king and queen of swords here with the devil coming out here. I'm just going to take the top. Um, so what I get is, yeah, there was some toxicity between the two of you or bad thoughts, bad memories, but this is also a connection that is very powerful and very divinely guided here. Okay. Um, is what I truly get. This may be a connection that does need some work, but this may also be a connection that can uh, prosper you know, there's something here. If you could just take a look at this from a different angle. So now we have, are you kidding me? Leo, now we have the king and the queen of pentacles. There could be work done in this connection. You just have to look at it from a different perspective. And what the perspective is, is more of the higher, more valuable perspective. 
um, where once you were arguing and there was something dark that happened and this was a fear of yours and this person that really does love you but may be unable to express that um, and what the higher message is is there can be work done here here's the queen of wands energy showing up Someone walked away, okay, and they have, let's see, yeah, they've definitely come to an understanding um, in this dark time, okay, that, what did they understand? What did they come to an understanding about? I know this person came to an understanding, yeah, so that something needs to end in order to have a new beginning. Death card and the empress. Um, this is saying there's two people here that can actually work you know it's it's almost meant to the strength card keeps on wanting to come out leo probably that's your energy so it may be really this message may be strongly for you with this two of wands um if you want to make this work you got to change your perspective and see the divinity within this connection or the divine energy within this connection so let's see what else we have here yeah, there's definitely a reconnection happening here, and it's going to lead to a new beginning. Um, and I'm seeing like this is someone's wish, and this is about someone who's single, finally getting everything they want. Okay, so two people coming together, the Six of Pentacles, bringing balance to a connection. Someone is going to start giving to you if you were the person that wasn't really receiving. Someone has had some time to truly think about things going within with the ace of pentacles um coming to like a realization let's see ten of pentacles that this is a fulfilling or can be a fulfilling situation i should say right leo so tell us more about what happened here where was there a dark spot you know what was this dark spot so there was definitely a transformation that had to go um, a, that had to kind of release some of their resistance to having a lot of power in another situation. We have the walking away. Someone had to go and literally work on themselves, okay? Who was that? Well, Knight of Wands is coming out. So there's a man and a woman energy, even though it's the Eight of Cups. So I do feel like both parties had a journey to go on, right? Um, one of them could have involved a marriage of some sort for someone or a home, um, okay? And the other one could have followed, could have had to follow their dreams and, you know, focus more on um, the divinity within them. That can be you, Leo. So the masculine energy here, it looks like they had to possibly deal with the home situation. The female energy here looks like they had to learn to follow their desires and their passions, Okay. And then now look what happens afterwards. Once both people have went on their journey, they get to come together. Um, Four of Wands and the Ten of Cups. So this is about coming together in union. The Star card. The Queen of Cups energy. This is really about someone with another person, um, their divine counterpart in union. A lot of female energy here. You could be dealing with the same sex relationship as well. Okay. So yeah, there is something coming together. There is a partnership um, and it's based on love. It's gone through a lot. It's someone that's single as well is coming in. So if someone wasn't single before, they're single now. And it looks like it would be the masculine energy um, that was hung on a dead end situation by the looks of it. Single now. So back to the original message, um, be as calm and peaceful as possible. And, you know, that's how you can overcome the dark memories. OK, and fear for that to be in the future, because that's not the case. here, OK. Thank you so much, Leos. I really appreciate you. And I wish you the best on this beautiful ending. It's a beautiful ending. Okay, bye for now.